you don't typically think of honeybee inspections during the winter. Um, but we actually do uh, provide honeybee inspection services uh, for dead out hives, so hives that have not survived during the winter. It can be difficult to know um, if your hives are dead or not if you go through prolonged periods of cold weather because you're not allowed to open them up. Um, but we do have access to this uh, infrared camera that allows us to tell whether or not there are live bees inside there. And if uh, there are live bees inside there, we will not open them. But uh, if bees uh, are, are dead, then we can open them up. We can take a look and see if we can find uh, what might have caused them to die. We'll take a look at the frames of brood to see if there was a brood disease that potentially was involved. Um, we can take the bees, uh, if there's dead bees, and we will uh, have them tested at our lab. We'll find out how many varroa mite were on them. We will dissect uh, their tracheal tubes to find out if there's tracheal, tracheal mite inside of uh, the bees. And uh, we'll also do testing for nosema disease. So it's a fluor infrared camera, um, and uh, what it allows us to do um, is essentially pick up the heat signature generated by the cluster of bees in the hive. Um, so the bees throughout the winter, um, some people imagine either that they, they freeze and then thaw out in the winter, or that they hibernate or something like that, but the bees are actually awake and alive throughout the winter uh, and they stay uh, in a cluster um, and they keep that cluster nice and toasty um, and we're able to pick up the heat from the cluster and uh, as long as the cluster is in there we'll be able to see the heat and we'll know whether or not the hive is live. They, uh, it, it is free um, to, to all beekeepers in the state of Utah, and um, we're happy to service anyone who has a pest or disease concern or just wants to know whether or not their bees are still alive.